this project has been a long project because we started it the first semester and uh, it's on geometry and so the first semester we covered point lines and planes and so that's when the students did uh, the actual drawing and design of their house on a 2D level and then uh, from there we put it into the computer so they learned how to use the, the computer program where uh, it's, it's um, an online computer program that anyone can, can use and it's for uh, engineering and architecture. This project is basically learning about the architectural design of a birdhouse which also involves geometry. Well this project was to incorporate geometry into real life situations, for example, building. And we had to incorporate it together, so we built a house using our angles um, and our squares and all that. And so they, they learned how to do that. And then from there, we, um, we cut the pieces using a CNC machine, which is like a drill that is that uses the computer program to cut the pieces electronically. And then when we did that, the students put the houses together and they then they decided what materials they were gonna be using to design and to decorate their houses, how much material of this, of each thing they needed. And to do that, they needed to find permit, perimeter area, surface area, volume, of all the parts of our house. If you think about it, birds aren't really the best, the best thing. But once we started building it, we started learning how fun it is and how interesting it is. I actually got a little bit of interest in two birds. So like for, especially for the roofs, we had to find out what angle to cut them at in order for them to fit in. And that helped us out with our geometry too. We had many places like finding out the perfect measurement for the roof, which involved the angle, the complementary to the other side, and other um, places such as cutting the right hole. Well, like like I said, it's like it connects to the real world, and like if you really like to build stuff, you can actually use geometry in order to help you for an architect or stuff like that. So I really like that we actually incorporate real world, real, real world with, um, with uh, school. They are learning not only geometry, they're learning to apply geometry, they're learning how geometry is actually in everything in, in our, around our world and how they can apply it to their everyday lives. And, and they're learning to work with other people, which is preparing them for real life and, and their future jobs. Well, if you want to become an architect, you would have to know geometry. If you want to become an engineer, it could be a civil engineer and you would have to do that. And so um, they decided on how it was going to look like, what colors, what materials, what they were going to do with it. And as you can see, we got a lot of different houses and it was, uh, I think the most important part of, of the project was they had to work together and they had to learn to um, talk to each other and, and talk about what decisions they had to make and, 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 and work together. Our obstacles were mainly the design because when, once you design something, Getting an idea is the easy part. Executing it and designing it is probably the hardest part. Well, I thought it was a really fun project because we don't normally do this in other types of math classes. And I actually liked it because it's more hands-on and involves the real world. Well, it was a very interactive project. I was able to like learn how to solve certain problems in and out of geometry. This project was actually amazing for me. I had so much fun. It was really a good time. I really like it because it, it definitely sticks in my mind more than just the teacher having us take notes. Like I can remember the kind of things that we have to do rather than to just date back to the day we took notes on a paper. The process of actually building it took about two weeks. The design also took like four weeks for the design. So we just 
uh, well, it was a long process being able to measure and center everything and to make sure that we had the right pieces. If they want to do it, they have to do it because it's something that you just can't miss out on. Because it's a different way of learning. It's a more interactive way to think and to elaborate on your knowledge. Uh, I, I want to add that this was a very hard project because it was a lot of hard work, but it was a very uh, good project, I think, because they learned what they needed to learn in geometry. They learned other things, and, and it came out really nice, the results of their houses. I'm very satisfied with, and they, 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 I think they enjoyed it. This can connect to real world as if helping out, maybe getting a part-time job, and you never know, maybe you could be the one building another Empire State Building.